It's the Buffalo Bills and the Miami Dolphins on Monday night. From beautiful South Florida, there's a look at Hard Rock Stadium in Miami. Tonight, we've got the crew set for what should be a real treat, a great Monday night matchup, as it'll be the Buffalo Bills taking on the Miami Dolphins. Now a guy who played his high school ball at Miami Central, it's James Cook to about the 33-yard line. Here's Allen to throw it. And that one goes incomplete on the drive. They'll try and start this drive in the air. And throws it on the move, but can't connect as that falls incomplete. Tua sets up to pass it. Got a man, it's Barrios complete. That'll leave him with a third and two coming up. They got eight yards. They'll try and run here with Mostert. And he's got the first down as he's up to the 45-yard line. Two and now on first down. This one complete to Jalen Waddle. And he's going to get this down to the 35 yard line. An excellent pickup of 20 yards. On second down, Tua. That's caught by the Notre Dame man. It's Durham Smythe. Well, they just keep marching right along. First down on a pickup of eight there. Break a tackle and turn into a bigger gain. Also, if they start to creep up, start to pressure receivers, now you go over the top, take it deep, and now you get some of those big shots downfield. It'll go as a gain of four. Play action, now it's Tua. And he's got it! And the Dolphins are going to be set up with a first and goal on a pass play that moves him all the way down to the run. I think he has to be saved or something. Going to the air, Tugga Bailoa. That is caught by Waddle. Touchdown, Miami. A one-yard touchdown pass. And the Dolphins will claim the early. Allen going to throw. He's got it complete to Stephon Diggs. And he's got it past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. Working out of the shotgun. Here's Allen. The oh, heck of a move. I guess no need to force it when you can do that instead. First down, 18-yard gain. That's caught by Gabriel Davis. They'll wind up getting seven on the play, and it's second down. Left side, Cook. There he goes, left side. And he's down inside the five at the four before he's out of bounds. Now Allen. Says caught for a Bills touchdown. Trent Sherfield from three yards out. And the Bills are an extra point away now from tying this ball game. On those slants, everything happened. Second down. Here's Mostert again. And not much there. Maybe a yard up in the Two are going to throw. And it's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. And this is what you want to see from a defense. And they both have specific outcomes in mind. To me, it just comes down to who can execute better and which side can step up and assert its will over the other. And they're going to have this across midfield and inside the 45. On first down, Allen. It's complete to Diggs. And they're going to be set up down around the 15-yard line. Allen. Oh, you saw that one coming. It's intercepted. Thrown back across his body. Picked up by Jalen Ramsey. And the Dolphins are going to take over at their own 13-yard line. And as we've seen, points have been precious so far. And they, just... they go back to the ground, this time Mostert. It'll be a pickup of a couple, and it leaves them with a third and three. Let's see if they do it anyway. Tug of Iloa going to try and throw on third down. A short throw there. That's to Smythe, the tight end. And he'll be tackled about two yards. Try to shake off the interception. He'll look to throw. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. To the air. Allen. Able to find the open man. That's complete. Now the Bills 
are going to use the first of their timeouts. Allen now looks to throw. He's got the hookup with Diggs. And he'll go out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. Involved early. Don't be surprised if they'll come right back to him again. They haven't shown the propensity to be able to stop him. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Again, they'll throw with Allen. And that is caught. Touchdown, Buffalo. Gabriel Davis, a five-yard touchdown. Not wanting to take a chance this time. They'll keep it on the ground. And a pretty good run, all things considered. Probably would have liked that in the first quarter. Now Tua. And he is caught. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. Tua, a final shot before half. Looking left sideline, incomplete. So we are at halftime here. Now they've got some time. The running game struggled in the first half. Opposition knows how to focus on defending the pass here. They've got to re-energize. He's got a man complete. Down to the 10. And all the way in for a Miami touchdown. Tyreek Hill, 78. Gets on for the rest of the half, keeping them in the driver's seat. Allen's throw going to be caught by Davis. He'll be dropped after a gain of about six. across. To throw, it's Allen. He's got the connection over the middle to Diggs. And Diggs will have a Bills first down up near the 40-yard line. Allen looks to throw on second down. And they've got it well across midfield down to the 40 before it's all said and done. Josh Allen, very athletic at 6'5", showing the first at the 40. On play action, Allen. Rush coming, and he's taken down. Finally hauled down for the first time this game. Multiple defenders in the down. Here's Allen to throw it. And that would be incomplete. Throwing his tongue of Iloa on third down here. They'll swing this out wide. Here's Achan. And they'll get him down about three yards short of the first and not try and force something that could put your team in some jeopardy. A good start to the drive here. That's caught out on the left side. Now he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. Into Miami territory, down at the 33. Now a throw here, hauled in. And this will leave him a yard short. Nice pickup of nine yards. On... Allen going to throw. Works right side into the hands of the tight end, Knox. And he doesn't quite make it, taking it within an eyelash. Dropped at the worst and goal at the one. Cook. Diving for the end zone, and he is in. Touchdown. And Charles, he's able to dive in there in a short yardage situation. Just find a place to get to the end zone. Didn't matter where it was, but once he did, used his... They'll start on the ground with Mostert. Oh, look at the juke. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. 15 yards is the pickup there, and the drive starting very nicely. On second down, Mostert. And hard running's going to get him over the 40 to the 42. Throwing now is Chungavailoa. And that is incomplete. About this defense, they came up with a couple big plays in this sequence. Here's Allen on first and ten. Boy stays up. Well, this is taken in. It's complete. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. An explosive 38 yard pickup. Allen now on first down. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. Now Allen throwing on second down. Put a pitch and catch to the tight end, Knox. And Knox is going to have a Bills first down as he'll take this down to the 20. Some yards, it may not go into the score sheet, but they count big for moving the ball and stretching the field. Really nice open field tackle. Throwing is Allen on third. 
He's got his target. That's complete. And he gets it inside the 10 to the 9. Now Allen. Touchdown, Bills! Dawson Knox, a touchdown grab from Josh Allen. And the Bills have opened up a two-touchdown lead here this fourth quarter. Well, that's certainly going to bump up the old win probability index because now it's a two-score game here in the fourth quarter. Hunter doesn't want to run out there anymore himself. He would love to see his offense put together a drive and give his leg a rest. And he's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good gain of nine on for a solid gain. Tua wants to throw it on second down. Gets this one to Hill. And brought down, but not before reaching. After the incomplete pass here now is second and ten. Here's Tua. And this is intercepted, and that should do it. Rasul Douglas picks it. And a terrific return as he takes this thing all the way down near the 20-yard line. This spot in the fourth quarter with that deficit had to throw the football. Unfortunately, there's the risk of big turn. Score lead, and now the ball back after the INT. And able to get him down, but he does reach the five. 86 yards on the ground for him now as he has gotten better, really, as the night's going on. A 10th carry in the game for Cook. And he's maybe going to get this back to the four, but that's about all. They run it again with Cook. And he is into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. James Cook. His second touchdown of the night. And the Bills have put this one to bed here in the fourth quarter. And he certainly... Where a quarterback had a streak of five straight games without a 200-yard game. And that was a big talk, both in his town and amongst his team. How do we get the passing game going? So Again, they will throw it with Tunga Bailoa. And he'll complete this one to Barrios. Tug of Iloa going to try and throw on third down. That's caught inside the 20. And he's going to be out of bounds all the way down inside the 15. Coordinators, you know why? Because receivers can be open at any point running that route. And that is caught. Touchdown, Miami. Tyreek Hill on the touchdown pass from Tua. And the Dolphins have got it back to a two score game here in the fourth. And yeah, that touchdown counts for their team, but I think it counts more for the fantasy guys, doesn't it? Time definitely not in their favor. Down two scores, but they'll try the onside kick. And this is going to be recovered by the Bills, and that should all but do it. Allen down to a knee, and that should just about do it. Well, this was a very close ball game at halftime, Charles, but in the second half, that offense kind of kicked things into another gear, and they were able to pull away for the victory. And, Brandon, I think they're the type of team that just looked in the mirror and said, hey, ton of pressure on, but we're the type of team that can flat out handle it. They stood up, stood up with confidence, and made it happen for a victory.